Hey, what's up, YouTube? This video is on the Hollow Sun HE 507C GR. GR designates grain. Comes with three reticle options the two MOA dot, 32 MOA circle, and the circle dot. It's equipped with the solar panel. It comes with one CR. 16, 1632 battery with a side mounted battery tray. It has 50,000 hours of battery life at setting six. It comes with memory functions and a motion sensor. It has 10 daylight settings and two night vision brightness settings under manual mode, Picatinny mount included, large push buttons on the side, IPX7 waterproof, and it's parallax free. So originally when, when I installed the SLR Rifle Works 5.0 ion light rail with their gas tube, I tried out the primary arms micro red dot. That is a phenomenal red dot for the money. Had no issues with the function of that red dot, but it sat a little bit, it sat very, very low uh, on the gas tube. And when you looked at the to MOA dot, the only thing you saw in the in the tube is the top of the hood hooded front sight. I didn't want to cut the front sight, so I figured I'd search for another red dot, and I kind of wanted something a little bit RMR style um, for the front end of this gun since it's already front heavy. So went to one of my local gun shops. And I purchased the Hollow Sun HE 507C GR. Like I said, the reticle is green, and I've got to tell you, I'm so far I'm impressed with it. Um, it the glass is very clear. the The green reticle, actually, all three reticles are very, very clear, and it was pretty easy to zero. Uh, my son and I we zeroed it at 25 yards. It took us about maybe 10 minutes, uh, 15 minutes, give or take, at the range, but it held up great. Uh, it's made of aircraft-grade aluminum. Like I said, it, it does have the solar panel um, at the top, which is a plus so that will help you with your battery life. And for me, one of the biggest things was having a side-mounted battery tray. I know some of the older Hollow, Hollow Sun uh red dots of this style uh, were manufactured where you had to take it off to change the battery. So I'm glad that they finally, you know, made the upgrade to the side mounted battery tray. But like I said, shooting this, um, it, it was pretty cool. Uh, the green reticles are very, very clear, which allows for easy target acquisition. And I'm, like I said, I'm just, I'm impressed. Um, let me show you pictures of each reticle. I tried my best to get the camera to focus, but let me show you the reticles now. Then we'll just get to some uh, quick shooting footage. All right, here's the uh, solar panel at the top. Looks like it's covered with some type of glass material. And here's the uh, other side of it. And that's really it. This red dot with the mount that it comes with is actually perfect because when you look through the glass, you only see just the little top piece of the front hood. So th this is perfect, it's lightweight doesn't take up a lot of space and it's not as big as bulky. You know, I've seen some videos where, uh, you know, guys have a huge big red dot sitting at the top. You know, I don't want it, you know, so high. So this is gonna work out perfect. Let's get to that shooting footage.
So all in all, I think the Holosun HE507C-GR is a phenomenal red dot in the $300 to $350 price range. Um, these red dots are able to be mounted onto pistols as well as rifles or sub guns. I really think um, with the size of the red dot, it shines on a pistol and it also shines on sub guns like CZ Scorpions or other, you know, other manufacturers and even, uh, a, you know, AK-47s as well. Um, great red dot for the money. So far, I give it two thumbs up. I've only got to test it a little bit today. I plan on doing some further testing with it uh, in the near future. But so far, um, I think it's a, a good solid option uh, in the $300 to $350 range. So I hope you liked the video. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. And as always, thanks for watching. And God bless.